Hello, hello, Mr. Newton here. So we are we are playing my PlayStation 4 right now. So I managed to connect it to the computer. I tried every tool for the computer. Unfortunately, the remote uh, re uh, replay uh, for the PS5 or PS4 do, do not work on my computer. I have a Windows 7 computer. I tried every every uh, like method and nothing worked. But I have a tool. I managed to connect. Um, I believe it's a uh, recording tool and uh, Aver Pro Recorder something. Anyway, I have uh, <coughs> uh, connected it to the Bandicam recording device on the computer uh, through a tool or a program named XSplit. So I have connected a tool to the computer and to the PlayStation 4 and to the TV. And uh, I have the XSplit program on the computer, um, and then I have the Bandicam program on the computer as well. So there are like two programs on the computer in play, and uh, then it's the, an external tool they had to, to buy. Okay, we will play some of the Mortal Kombat um, 10 game, I think. I played some of this game before, I believe already in 2015, when I first bought the game. Then I believe later in 2022, then I uh, rebought it because the first time I bought it was the CD version of the game that I lost when I sold the console, and then then I uh, rebought it uh, in the DLC format in 2020. But unfortunately, uh, the recording software that follows the PlayStation 4 it uh, it has a problem. I believe it's impossible to record certain scenes, not in this game, but in some other games, which is annoying. And also, you are playing live when you use it, and live means I don't get as many views as if I play uh, when I'm not live. So I prefer um, not playing live on my YouTube channel, I get more views that way. Okay, uh, but we'll try this. And also I dislike when there are like copyright uh, hidden scenes in games when you play live. Certain scenes in the story won't be recorded. That's why I wanted to use the remote play, but unfortunately it didn't work on Windows 7. Now I think I have solved it. Uh, we'll try this. And I believe the recent version of Bandicam, I've always used an old outdated version of Bandicam. I believe the recent version of Bandicam uh, allows me to upload immediately the videos without uh, having to progress them like I've done with every video previously. Let's start the game. Uh, we'll exit uh, Final Fantasy 14. Start this. We'll come at Excel or I believe 11 probably or 10 large. to finish the story in this game before I play the later one. I also have that game. So I have Mortal Kombat 9 as well for the PlayStation 3 that I want to play, but I do not have it connected to the computer yet. So I, I prefer Sonya Blade in that game. She's way better looking and she's my favorite character by the way in Mortal Kombat. Okay, let's press the start button. She's kind of uh, older in this game. Especially in the, in the Mortal Kombat 11 game, I believe this is Mortal Kombat 10, and they have 11 too. Okay, so one player story. So I could continue because I've already played some in this story. We'll, we'll start from scratch, I believe, and play some this game. So, new game. A new game will cause you to lose your previous game's progress. Sure, you wish to continue with a new game. Well, that sucks. Could continue. I played the, the earlier parts, or most of them, I believe, uh, on my YouTube channel in, in live play. Now I'm not playing live, so. Well, maybe we should just continue.
Sisat. <clears throat> All right. So this is a play test using the tool. So I tried using the tool with XSplit before when I played a Warcraft of the War battle um, and I wanted it in 1080 uh, I believe uh, 1920, 1080 resolution but I ended up with 720 resolution using the streaming feature of XSplit now I'm using Bandicam and also I found um, how to increase the resolution all the way to 4000 the XSplit program, so I didn't know how to use it properly previously. So I decided to try play the PS4 here. Unfortunately, I had problems using the PS4. Fuck, I missed with that attack. Still won the battle. Okay, so I had problems using the PS4 on, on playing the PS4 uh, on my YouTube channel because uh, I was forced to use streaming and. Uh, I almost get no use using stream and also in other games, I believe this game was one of the exceptions it would uh, show all the cutscenes and such even when I played uh, live uh, using the feature that followed with the PlayStation 4 but uh, for the later Mortal Kombat game and most games uh, there is like uh, hidden scenes during the stories so you can't really record everything and that sucks and I wanted to fix that by installing the remote play but it didn't work on the PlayStation 4 and I didn't think about it using XSplit before I tried using it for Warcraft Total War to stream Warcraft Total War but the resolution was so bad 720 pixels so, so I, um, I will try that again now that uh, because I know now how to increase the resolution but I, I'm not sure I will stream I might actually just play without streaming because the new Bandicam version allows me to uh, upload without streaming and without progressing the video in, in a movie program so that's very good you know the reason I wanted to stream to Twitch was because uh, well we can watch, watch this first uh, before I continue there are a lot of cutscenes in this game or rather uh, the reason I wanted to stream was because otherwise uh, I used to start uh, movie programs like Filmora Movie Maker etc and then process the video so if you played it for two hours then you had to uh, process the video for four hours so it took four hours before the video was ready to be uploaded to YouTube and by streaming I could uh, upload everything immediately uh, at the same time I'm playing but uh, streaming ended up having worse quality and such it was bad but now I think I can increase the quality and also I don't need to stream it uh, because uh, the new program uh, the new version of Bandicam let's see this first Alright, so the new version of uh, Bandicam allows me to upload immediately after I have recorded a video, so I don't need to process it anymore. So for example if I play for two hours, then I can upload it immediately. It won't, I won't have to wait uh, four hours before I can upload a video, which is annoying. It will speed up everything if I can upload immediately. So I'm interested in trying to upload this uh, as soon as... I've done recording, I will play a few fights and uh, see a few scenes and then I will upload. This is just a, let, uh, tr a trial. We will <coughs> restart the story mode 
if if I'm gonna play this on my YouTube channel. But I, I think I want to replay Mortal Kombat 9 first. So I have played about uh, a bit of this story, not too much, but not uh, too little either. I played for a bunch, uh, a couple of hours. But uh, Mortal Kombat 9, I believe I finished uh, back in 2011. I, I'd like to replay it because the story is uh, continuing on that story. And the next game is continuing on this story. So it's good to go from one, one story to the other. And also Mortal Kombat 9 is very much like the original movies in terms of its story. Because it has the same story as the movies. I liked it the, the most. Also the women are better looking in, in that game too. Sexier, but... Uh, Graphics are better here, of course. This is a later game. Mortal Kombat 9 is for PlayStation 3. And this is for PlayStation 4. And then the next game, Mortal Kombat 11, is also for, for PlayStation 4, but it uh, looked way better than this one. So, uh, because this one was released in 2015, when the PlayStation 4 was, uh, I believe, two years old, or one and a half years old. And uh, Mortal Kombat 11 was released in 2020, I believe, or 2019. So it's uh, a later game. So it looks way better. Good. I managed to do this uh, special move. I don't remember the name. I have a word for it. I don't like playing as Raiden. Yeah, we won the battle. There are worse characters in this game. I am used to playing uh, with Sonya Blade and her daughter. Those are the ones I'm good at. And Johnny Cage. I like Johnny Cage the most in the movie. Uh, together with Sonya Blade, of course. I like the air story. I don't like in the Mortal Kombat 11 game that Sonya Blade is so old. In this game she is middle aged and in that game she is almost old and uh, in 9 she is actually good looking. Okay. So I'm controlling Raiden here, the mage. This is my first PlayStation 4 video where I speak because I didn't have a microphone uh, when I played on the PlayStation 4. Now I'm playing on the computer, so the, the PlayStation 4 is on, I'm connected to the device. The device is connected to XSplit, and XSplit throws some Bandicam, so, and I'm using Bandicam to record and XSplit. That way I get a uh, way better resolution. So Final Fantasy VII Remake didn't work on my Windows 7. I get an power something DLL error. I'm trying to fix it but it seems very difficult because I would like to play it on the computer. Uh, because that allows me to mod it to be more like the original game. You know, Tifa can, can look more correct and such, like it did in the 97 game. But uh, in the worst case, I will have to play it on the PlayStation 4. I have the PlayStation 4 game. I bought it uh, as soon as it released back in 2020. But unfortunately, Tifa looks... Uh, she, she's changed. She doesn't have the same clothes. I don't care about her breasts, but I didn't like her different clothes. I like the leather skin um, skirt that she had in the original game and in the cinematics especially. I thought she was hot in the cinematics. And also I like the white t-shirt. I didn't like the additions of that black stuff beneath it and such, underneath it. So I wanted to mod the game so she would get her looks back, but um, it doesn't work on my Windows 7 computer. I have a DLL error that I'm trying to fix, but if that fails I will have to play the PlayStation 4 version.
where she will look different, unfortunately. I, I'm not a fan of changes to the original. But what I wanted was the same game with better graphics. I, I am okay with the new battle system. I like that they've added something new when it comes to how you fight and such. That's uh, That makes sense for a new game. And also I, I like... Uh, uh, I am fine with the realistic style of the characters, even though I like the anime style too. Uh, but uh, let's say I am I'm also fine with additions to the game story, for example, scenes that weren't thrown in the original game but were spoken about, like saying, for example, kidnapping Marlene from Aerith and such. All those uh, additions uh, that were in the story but were never shown in the original 1997 game. I'm fine with them being added, but I don't like changes to the story that changes the story. So for example, the Kingdom Hearts creatures that show up, or for example, we lost uh, into a retry, uh, or for example, changes like uh, resurrecting Zack, for example. He should uh, die like in the original story. I don't like when they change the story. Uh, there's a difference between changing the original story and adding new uh, gameplay uh, that we are in the story but were never shown. I'm, I'm uh, positive to the later but negative to the changes down to the old story and especially negative to any change uh, of the character's looks if they make them less attractive, you know. Tifa was... Uh, I believe everyone who played Final Fantasy VII thought she was kind of hot. And uh, changing that because of modern politics is stupid. <coughs> That's why I wanted to use the play, uh, PC version to change her back. But I might be forced to play the PS4 version. Alright. Now we are playing Mortal Kombat 10. Okay, as yes, Raiden, I need to focus. Um, didn't focus enough when I spoke. Need to win this fight too. I think we will play through Raiden's story. Fuck, he managed to do this attack. But we have a lot of health this time, so it's fine. We won't lose. Even though we got to do that attack. So I want my YouTube channel to be more active, and I want to upload videos more often. But uh, and it was a big problem to always have to process every video. I played the Medieval 2 mod for 3 hours, then I had to wait 6 hours for the process processing of the video. Uh, yeah. If it was 6 hours, it took over 12 hours. So now, fortunately, I won't have to wait. That's my hope. And then I will be more active. Then I can play and upload, play and upload. Instead of play, process, upload, play, process, upload. Okay, and I've played more of the console. I've, I've owned a PlayStation 4 since 2020. I've hardly, hardly played it. I also owned one in 2015, but I got rid of it in late 2015. <coughs> I've owned the PlayStation 3 since 2009. So. Uh, but uh, I want a Nintendo Switch. I can play Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, but I do not have one currently. So I, I have the PS3, the PS2, the PS4, and a gaming computer, but it's Windows 7, unfortunately. Which is good for older games, but not for the later ones. Okay, I also have a PlayStation port, but like, actually I have two of them. With custom firmware and everything. Uh, but uh, PlayStation 2 is more worth it to play on the computer using the emulator, the PS2 emulator, because the graphics are way better. Same with the PSP. Instead of streaming the PSP, it's better to play on the computer. 
using an emulator. The graphics are much better in both uh, for both the PlayStation and the PSP. This was just a test, first test of the PlayStation 4. Ah, now it's chapter 11, Jack yeah, Bricks. I've played for 11 chapters, or I played 10 chapters now, and I probably will restart everything to get the story from scratch. Even though I have some of the episodes on uh, the live stream, I didn't play everything. I believe quite a bit uh, was not recorded. We probably would be wise in restarting everything. Then then probably we play the PlayStation 3 game first, the 9 game. Mortal Kombat 9, that story is actually really good. And uh, Sonya Blade is looking the best too. Okay. See this uh, cinematic, and then we will uh, exit. Could probably have slightly higher sound too. Put it a little bit too low. I will increase it a bit. And yeah, I want to play some of the games I bought for the PlayStation Four and. And three. I have some games that I bought for the PlayStation 3 that I haven't played yet, including uh, two fighting games based on anime. I be believe it. You, you, and no, no, I was wrong. I believe it's uh, um, I believe it's uh, just the name. Yo Yo's Bizarre Adventure. I believe it's similar to the Naruto games, the Naruto and Ninja Storm games, but it's Yo Yo's Bizarre Adventure. I also have a Sensei game too that is similar, but <coughs> unfortunately, <coughs> I do not know much of the animes. So I, I, I wanted to watch the anime uh, before I <coughs> play those games. They are not open yet. But the anime of Saint Seiya is very long, it has over a hundred episodes. S and Jojo's Bizarre Adventure is three seasons long, so... But yeah, those games will certainly be played at one point or another. I also have a bunch of role-playing games. For the PlayStation 4 it's Final Fantasy Remake, it's Dragon Ball Z Kakarot, and it's the Dragon Ball uh, Xenoverse games. I am not currently subscribing on the internet service, so I won't play it unless I resubscribe. I also believe I got Final Fantasy fourteen, and I have some others too. Oh, we can fight with uh, Yaku Briggs. She's actually pretty good in the next game. It has a, has a spawner skin. It's been a while since I played, so... Oh, I picked up a tool there. Okay, for the PlayStation 3 I also have some role-playing role games, and for the PlayStation 2. For any PlayStation 2 game we will use the emulator. So I have, I believe, Final Fantasy 12 for both the PlayStation 4 and the PS2. The benefit of using the PS2 version is that I have the action replay tool, so I can cheat, because I remember when I played it without cheating, back in 27 I believe, when I was home, uh, my parents house, it was one of the last games I, I bought, uh, before moving out, uh, I believe the problem was that there was an area where I couldn't progress, because I would die all the time, the entire team would die, because Final Fantasy 12, unlike the earlier games, in the Final Fantasy series had uh, real-time battles, so the field and the battles were not separated. So if you died uh, on the 
field you died uh, and got game over and uh, the enemies could attack you on the field so you were never safe it wasn't like in the older titles where you could retreat from the battle and uh, uh, then be safe uh, in, in the FF12 game they attacked you on the field so you couldn't retreat and I had to use a sheet to make myself uh, stronger in order to not uh, get game over at a certain spot in the game all the time could probably be fixed by grinding too you know uh, but uh, yeah that's the benefit of using the PS2 version that they have actually replay sheets if I use the PS3 version I can't cheat which means I will need to grind otherwise I won't be able to progress po uh, and uh, by the way I think the Final Fantasy 12 game is very good I never finished it I have the uh, Brad strategy game too both the pocket version and the inbound version uh, but um, yeah I never finished it I believe I bought it in 27 or 28 I believe it was 27 when it released then I couldn't put it down the first time I played it then after I finally did put it down after I played it for hours the first time it was really really good and then then I somehow never returned it because I I don't know why I, I have been it's like I mostly uh, play computer games but when, whenever I started it I couldn't uh, stop playing for many hours I tried to play the stuff I did in 27 back in 2013 but I never played it since then so I want to finish that game I have the PS4 version and and the PS2 version I don't know which one I will play and action replay do not work in the emulator I believe so maybe it will be the PS3 version I will play or, or if it is PS4 I think it's PS4 have some other role playing games too let's quit to the main menu ok so other role playing games I have um, they are either PS3 games or PS2 games uh, I believe and they have some PS3 uh, no they are either PlayStation 3 or PlayStation 4 I believe I have uh, Kingdom Hearts all games in, in PS4 format they have uh, Tales of Sympho Symphonia for the PlayStation 3 it's an old um, Nintendo GameCube role-playing game that they used to have on the Nintendo GameCube back in the day but it's the PS3 version which is remastered and yeah I want to play that too it's a really good game there is even an anime based on it that they also have okay but I never finished the game I played quite a bit on the GameCube version I've never opened the PS3 version okay and I have some others too that I want to play so I have a lot of console games and a lot of PC games that I want to play alright but thanks for watching and I will upload this and then we will the next computer game I, I mean console game I will play like this I will start the story from, from this scratch Okay, but I believe we will play Mortal Kombat 9 before we return to this game, and then we will play this from the start, I believe. Uh, but other games besides Mortal Kombat may, might be Final Fantasy 7 Remake, uh, Dragon Ball Z Kakarot, which I also have on the computer. Might might be more worth it to play it on the computer, because unlike Final Fantasy Remake, it did work on the computer uh, for me on my 7 computer uh, and then I have as I said a bunch of Final Fantasy games I have Final Fantasy 10 and 10 2 they are PlayStation 2 games I do not have the remastered versions but if I play them on the emulator they will still look very good it will look like PS3 games if I play on the emulator ok anyway uh, other games will be a surprise ok and we will also play the PC games such as Spell Force uh, Freedom Force and uh, Medieval 2 of course, Final Fantasy 7 maybe. Okay, thank you for watching and see you.